Show me your ways, O Lord. Teach me your paths. Lead me in your truth and teach me, for you are the God of my salvation. On you I wait all the day. Psalm 25, 4 to 5. This is Fluffy. He is Cooper's rabbit. It was given to him as a gift by his dad. Because it was cold outside, Cooper's dad built a cage, and they put Fluffy and the cage in the basement where it was warm and cozy. Every night for two weeks, Cooper went downstairs, fed his rabbit, and cleaned the cage. It was his responsibility to take care of Fluffy. After a few weeks, Cooper got a little tired of going down to the basement and taking care of his rabbit. It wasn't fun anymore. It had turned into a job. One night, Cooper's mom said, When was the last time you cleaned out the cage, Cooper? Cooper thought, Last week? But he answered, I'll do it right away, Mom! So he went down to the basement. When he got there, he could hardly go near the cage. He had to pinch his nose. The smell was awful, and Fluffy wasn't white anymore. He had turned almost white. So Cooper washed Fluffy, replaced the dirty newspapers with new ones, played with Fluffy for a bit, put it back in the cage. Then he had a brilliant idea. He remembered that his sister had just gotten a new bottle of perfume and bath powder. He decided to make Fluffy smell extra nice so that he wouldn't have to clean it every day. So Cooper went upstairs, snuck into his sister's room, got the perfume and bath powder, and hid them under his shirt. He quietly walked by his mother and went back to the basement. There, he sprayed the cage and Fluffy with perfume and powdered Fluffy with a generous amount of bath powder. Then, Cooper tucked the bottles under his shirt, snuck past his mom, and went into his sister's bedroom. Then, he put back the bottles where he found them, and luckily, his sister was nowhere to be seen. Then he thought, poof, nobody's seen me. A little later, his sister arrived. She stood still and started sniffing the air. Then she said, I smell my perfume. She hurriedly went to her room and came out with her almost empty bottles. She looked at Cooper and asked, Cooper, what did you do? At that point, Cooper's mom intervened. Cooper thought she didn't know what happened, but she did. So she asked Cooper and his sister to go down to the basement and see what had happened to the perfume and bath powder. When they got down there, Cooper's mom started laughing so hard that even his sister started laughing too. Poor Fluffy was covered with powder and its cage was wet with perfume. It really smelled, but this time it smelled super good. Cooper's mom explained to him what he had done wrong. Here are the things Cooper realized and learned. 1. Cooper promised to take care of Fluffy, but he broke the promise. 2. Cooper became lazy. 3. His brilliant idea was not of God. 4. The seed came because of the idea. 5. Cooper actually stole to complete the idea. 6. Cooper hid his wrong actions. 7. Cooper hurt his sister. So what happened to Cooper? He apologized to his sister, but he was never allowed to go into her room again without permission. Also, his dad made sure he cleaned Fluffy's cage every night from then on. God sees all we do, but if we ask Him, He will lead us into truth and into doing the right things. I'm Gio, and thank you for watching. Happy Sabbath!